Logan, Logan, move. Bender. I look just like all of you, but I can bend water. My aim is to be the best and to beat the rest, but... I am the firebender. I also look just like all of you, but I can bend fire. My aim is to burn everyone. But you wanna hate me? Hey mama, 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 you wanna hate me? Yes, there's pepper everywhere. And I've been using my fire. Okay, the fire's not coming now. Alright, I've been using my fire to separate the pepper. Uh -huh. But it's not going. Okay. So wait. Everyone, please, you can try this at home. And it definitely works. Okay, clearly all of you can see that there is a lot of pepper in this water. So what I'm gonna do right now I'm going to move this pepper all the way to the sides of the water. Trust me, I'm a water bender. I can do this. Oh, please. Not like just now I feel. Just wait. People, I have some original hand soap. Scientifically proven to kill 99.9% .9 of germs. Buy that all. And Don't also think of me as a promoter. Sorry. I'm going to squirt some soap over my finger. I have some good soap here guys. Now watch carefully as I put my finger into the solution. Wow. Wow. Everything moves to the side. Everything did move to the side. How did you do that? Ah, let me explain. Soap reduces tension. This causes the pepper sprinkles to move to the side of the tray, thus causing tension to reduce in water.
Hey, water builder. What are you doing? Ah, don't do it, Mila. Please. Sorry. Uncontrollable power. What, okay. what is this? This is a magic fluid. Magic fluid? As you know, I'm a water bender and I mess with fluids. So, one fine day, my mom, Awai Iyo Tapu, decided she let me learn this trick of mastering fluids. So, here's this fluid. Now, my first experiment out of this fluid is try to mold a ball out of it. A ball? A ball. With liquid? Yes, come on, try it. Yeah. I don't think I can do a ball with it. Wait, I will demonstrate to you how amazing science is. Take a clump of this magic liquid. Alright. Then roll it up and keep on rolling it and keep on rolling it. And then you form a ball. But don't forget, you shouldn't let this ball go. Or not, this it liquefies. Yeah, it liquefies. So once again, let me show a demonstration for all of you out there. I take this liquid, take it a bit more, mold it up, keep on rolling the liquid, keep on rolling. It's like a bubble, just keep on rolling it. Keep on rolling and keep on rolling this liquid and don't let go, don't let go or not this will happen. But where's the ball? I made the ball. You just didn't observe clearly. Watch this. One and a two and a one and a two and a one and a two and a one and a two. Can you see the ball? Can you move it up a little bit? Yeah, I can see a ball. Am I not right? But then you liquefy. Yes, that's true. How do you so here? It? Let me tell you that firstly, as a water bender, I can control liquids. And secondly, let me explain about this magic goo. This magic goo, magic goo, is known as Oo Black. This name is quite peculiar, right? But actually it's from a book known as Dr. Seuss. And it was written by him. So, what was in that story was, there was this character named Bartholomew and the Oo Black. So the Oo Black is actually a non-Newtonian liquid. Let me explain further about this. Oo Black is a non-Newtonian liquid between solid and liquid. When pressure is forced against the liquid, it turns into a solid. When left just like that, the molecules separate and turn back to liquid. Hey, what happened? Hi. I see you stirring something. Yeah, yeah. You know how many times you outshine me just now? Like, I could try two times. Alright? Two times. Now, I'm going right, to outshine times. you. Yeah, I'm the water bender two times. Yeah. You want to get burned? <laughs> no. Hey, you want to get wet? Fine, fine. Just keep it down. Alright. Ah. Now, I'm going to show you how I'm going to summon you. Fire snake. Fire snake. Yes. Fire snake. <laughs> fire snake. That's why you're wearing white. I'm the purest kind of fire. Alright? Really? Keep it cool, man. Okay. Alright. Now, okay. I have a solute, a mixture, alright, of baking soda and fine sugar. Alright. Now, the first thing we do is we get sand. Alright. I'm gonna put the sand right on top here. Would you mind making it like a little bit circling? Ah, uh, yeah. I'll help you. Never mind. Yeah. That, are you done yet, water bender? No, I'm not done yet. Why are you so slow? I just like being slow. Okay. Now are you done? Yes, I'm done. Alright. Now, we add eth ethanol or anything flammable can do. We pour it onto the sand. Dum 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 dum. Don't do sound effects please. Dum 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 dum. Okay. After we do that. Wait guys, wait, wait. I'll pour a bit more ethanol to help him bury better. Carry on. Alright. Sorry for the disturbance. Alright. Now, we add the mixture of baking soda and sugar onto the sand. And also, don't smell the ethanol, please. Alright. Then, we add ethanol again 
around it. Be careful, fire bender. Do you do you think it's enough for the bender? Hmm, I think a bit more will do. Now, for the final part, and the reveal of my powers, a matchstick. Sorry, I'm broke. Children, you please do this at home, with the advice of your parents. Okay, now, we light it up. Yes, my powers are nothing today. Alright, watch and learn. Safety precaution, don't stand too close to the fires. Uh, then... Ha! Huh. As you can see, they are black snakes, or fire snakes as I like to call them, growing out of the big mixture of baking soda and sugar. Can you see that? Hmm, quite interesting, bro. Yes, yes. You have summoning powers. You shouldn't call yourself the firebender. You should call yourself the animal bender. A hell snake coming out of fire. It's true, I think I should change my name to that. Why can we change the IC numbers? <laughs> yeah, Alright, true. Ah, leave that aside. Wow, just look at that. It's growing. Yes, it is growing. It's growing. And it's hot. Very hot. Wow, you're not used to your own element. I'm the purest of fire. It is hot. It is really, really hot. Even I feel the heat. I feel like my earth Okay, we'll leave this by. Now, do you understand how does this happen? No, I don't really understand it, but I know you have summoning powers. Yeah, aside from the summoning powers, let me explain. The snake is a result of the combustion of sugar and baking soda. In simpler terms, the baking soda burns with sugar to make it rise. What are you holding there, Firebender? Oh, I'm holding an ice cube, Firebender. Uh, something I really love. Brings back memories. Yeah, not for me. But since you can create it, can you undo it? No, 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 I'm not used to undoing stuff. But do you have any ways of undoing this? Mm, no, I don't. I'm the water bender, I can only form more ice. That's why you have to make fire bender. Right. Now, I'm going to prove to you that I can melt ice with my bare hands. <laughs> what are you taking there? Nothing specifically, but now I will take a cube of ice and I'll press on it and you'll see it melting before your eyes. Holy cow. <laughs> okay, 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 that's enough firebender. This is hurting my feelings. Really? Wow! Okay, this wow. happens. Alright, do you know how did I do it? Do you know? No, I have no idea. Nothing specifically. Let me explain. Pressure causes heat to increase. Salt speeds melting. This causes the ice to melt in the hand. 